Hi you guys, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm gonna be doing a review. I was waiting on this product to get it here for a good amount of time. It actually didn't take that long. It got here pretty quick, but I was waiting on it to be able to film a review on it. I ordered myself a ring light. It took me a little while to choose on an actual ring light because I wanted to get something that wasn't too expensive, that wasn't too cheap, but yet was affordable. Something that was gonna work for a good amount of time and something that was better quality. So I could have better quality videos, better looking videos. I definitely needed a ring light. So I went ahead and bought one. I'll definitely consider the ring light that I got affordable. It was only $20. I'm pretty sure you can find some cheaper than that, but I don't know if the quality would be the same as the one that I got. I got mine on eBay. There's so many ring lights on eBay. You can find some on Amazon and many other websites online, but I happened to purchase mine from eBay. The ring light that I purchased is 10 inches. It's definitely not the one that's down on the floor. It's just 10 inches. It's like about maybe this big it's big it's not that big but it's definitely a good size and definitely good quality if you're barely starting youtube or if you just wanted to take good pictures with perfect lighting or you know anything anything that you want to use it for it's definitely good quality a good size i definitely recommend for you to get this ring light if you're looking for one i already opened the ring light but i put it back in this packaging the only reason that i opened it was to see if i received all the pieces to make sure that it all came together and i also turned it on just to see if it did work so if there was any issues i'd have to return it you know give my money back and all of that but that was the only reason that i did open it so i would definitely be i guess you could say trying it for the first time again and actually use it in a video to see if it does give me the quality that i want and the quality that i paid for so you're gonna be going through this review with me so the ring light came in a box of course this is what the box looks like it's a pretty small box it's not that big it did come with bubble wrap so whenever you open it and unwrap it it comes in a little bubble wrap bag and then you take it out of that bag and then it's in a little box this is what it looks like of course it's not that small but you know that's what it looks like on the picture right now my lighting like my natural lighting is somewhat there i have my window open i have my actual room light on and i have a lamp <laughs> but um to be able to test it i'm gonna turn everything off i'm gonna close the window so i won't be having any type of light in my room so you can be able to see the quality of the ring light itself so it comes like this right and then you take it out and it comes with all that stuff Ugh. ring light itself as you can see it's the size of my head it's it's pretty big it's a pretty good size if i say so myself it comes with the actual ring light itself and with a long cord the, the cord is pretty long it's pretty long it, it does not come with the box i got the box myself and then it comes with the bottom piece the piece that goes to the middle and the piece that gets everything together and it comes with a little clicker thing whenever i saw it i was like oh. i needed that this little clicker you know it's just you click it and it takes the picture for you it starts recording for you it is great and it's definitely gonna come in handy so for the ring light itself it's not glass it's actually like really good quality plastic so it definitely won't break if you happen to drop it it came in good quality it came how they said it was gonna come so i definitely rated it 85 stars on ebay i'll be having the link down in the description box so you can go ahead and check it out if you plan on buying one whenever i first got it i thought it was missing a piece because i didn't actually put it together how it's supposed to go but my mom helped me so i wasn't missing a piece i was just a little dumb okay so it comes with the ring light like this pretty big pretty good size okay so then to put everything together you know just put it together just put it together i'm pretty sure this is what goes what you put first okay yeah and boom you can bro i mean you can use this as a little tripod itself you know it you gotta do what you gotta do but i'm definitely not gonna be using this as a tripod because my phone as of right now is on a tripod itself like just a plain tripod which i will be linking down in the description box as well if you definitely want to check that out i don't 
remember how it goes. Something was, oh, and it also comes with a little phone holder. Um, it did not come with instructions, but the instructions are on, on the app, so you could definitely check that, but I don't, I don't quite recall how this goes. Oh, never mind. I do. Kind of. Not really. Okay. So you put this little spot, this little spot, this little part first, so it's, boom, it's on. And then this part comes in. We put this here. Boom. Then we have the bottom piece, which is the piece that actually opens up to be like the little stand that you're going to have it. That's gonna basically hold the tripod for you. Um, you put that at the bottom. Okay. So boom. Comparison to me is down to my stomach. <laughs> I don't know if that even helps you. It's pretty big though. It is arm length probably. Yeah, literal arm length. <laughs> Okay, then it comes with the holder, so you will definitely not have to purchase another tripod because it'll be a tripod on its own. You um, you put this in the center of it, uh, and it's like flexible, so you can adjust it to however you want. If you want it landscape or if you want it portrait, you know, you can move it. First of all, you can move it around and this the little holder the actual holder you could twist it i swear you could twist it but how oh you untwist it from here and then you're able to twist it to put it however you want but i wanted mine like this you know because i'm gonna be recording landscape wise so whoa it's not crooked so let's start with that boom it's pretty good it's crooked was that my fault yeah of course <sighs> okay so boom it's on correct so then you're gonna plug your little cord onto the wall and we will be able to see what that lighting actually looks like so i just connected it i still haven't turned it on but you know it's connected um the way oh, i'm uh disconnected hold up i didn't show you the actual way to turn it on and i couldn't reach it right now but okay so let me show you so it comes with the cord the cord itself has a little button the button it has different buttons uh, it has a power button it has a plus a minus sign and it has like a little circle you know um and that is all it has the power button of course is turning it on and off the minus sign is to lower down the light you know like make it a little dimmer yeah the little this one whatever that is um that one changes the mode I don't know. Um, it gives you a cooler light, um, a more warmer light, and a plain white light. So that definitely does come in handy. And then you have the plus sign, which just, um, I can't even see it. It's kind of blurry. There we go. Um, the plus sign just adds more light. <laughs> yeah. Common sense. You could just, you'll definitely know how to work it whenever you get it. It's pretty easy to work with also. So that's great. So now we're going to go ahead and plug it back in. Okay. It is connected. You know what? I have a plug right here. I don't know why I'm struggling. Okay. So it is now connected. Again, we'll plug in, not connected. Oh, the, the little clicker. Wherever it went. The clicker. Is, uh, it's connected by Bluetooth. So you can see your phone by Bluetooth. You will know whenever it turns on because it starts flashing. Boom, it's flashing. So that's how you know it's on. And then once it gets connected, it stops flashing so you can know that it's connected. Anyways, let's get to the freaking ring light, dude. What am I taking so long for? This needs to be tight. Okay, so now it's all set up. So this is how you make it. So it's set up. No, it's quirky. Okay, now it's straight, it's set up. So now you get to turn it on. So whenever you turn it on, you click the little power button and she's bright. She's very, very bright. So now I'm gonna go ahead and set it up with my phone so we can be able to see the, the lighting difference. Okay, so this is what it looks like. 
you know, just regular home lighting, the lighting in my room, the lighting that I'm able to get without a ring light. I'm gonna go ahead and turn my lights off and close the curtain so I won't be getting any natural light, any type of light so you can be able to see the actual full potential of the ring light itself. Uh, I had turned everything off, but it was completely dark in here. So it's only my lamp on right now. So the lighting definitely changed a lot. It definitely did, you can definitely tell. So now I'm gonna go ahead and finally adjust my actual phone to the ring light so we can be able to see the potential of the ring light. Let me just remind you one more time, this is with no ring light, no ring light, no ring light. It is now on the ring light, but the ring light is not on. So now you're seeing the difference, the height difference from my regular little tripod. This tripod is super small, but it definitely is convenient. And you could definitely use it if you're starting off and you don't want to purchase a ring light yet. This one is definitely something to buy. It's as well as same thing, you know, pretty good. It's convenient. Um, But now I'm going to go ahead and turn the ring light on. The ring light is now on. She's pretty good. She's pretty good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's super bright. And this is with no lights in my room. So if I was to turn the light on in my room, this is what it would look like. Same thing, but you know, now the background is more out there. But if you definitely want it to be just you that you're in focus, make sure that you're the spotlight of the video, basically, you could go ahead and turn your lights off. And this is how it looks so now i'm gonna go ahead and show you the different settings on the extra ring light okay so first i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all the different modes so this is just plain white light this is more of a cooler light and if you see it in person it'll look like kind of bluish but it definitely doesn't make you look blue on the actual camera so this is the cooler mode then we have more of a warmer tone for the actual light which it, it's not bad. I really like how it looks. It looks pretty cute. I like how it looks. Um, This one would be better, you know, for pictures maybe. You know, for an actual video, you want to get more of a studio lighting, I guess you could say. Which the white tone would definitely go perfect for that. But then you have the cool tone and this is the warm tone. The white light. Cool tone. Warmer tone. Okay, so those are the different tones that it has. So right now, it's at its brightest. Is definitely on the brightest level I guess you could say um, so this is the brightest that it'll get so I'm gonna go ahead and show you the dimmest one okay so this is the dimmest tone that it has this is the dimmest one and even it being dim it's still a good amount of lighting that it gives you so even if you don't want too extreme of a light this would be the perfect lighting for you the perfect lighting for you for sure okay so this is barely the first little level of light I don't know what to call it the first set of light or whatever you want to call it. Okay, this is the first one. So then we have the second one. This is the second one. It's still, you know, it's it's still good. It still gets the job done. Even if it would have came this dim, I would have not been mad at it. So then we have the third one. This is the third one. Looks looks good to me. Looks good to me. This is the fourth one. It only gets better <laughs> it really it all depends to you how bright you want it how dim you want it you know the kind of vibe that you're going for in the video and even this looks good itself this is the brightest the brightest and the other ones are bright on their own this is what the fifth level i believe this is not the brightest this is the brightest there's still another one <laughs> it only gets better this is the brightest that it gets definitely the brightest so yeah we're able to compare the dimmest to the brightest this is the brightest i lied that is not the brightest this is it i swear this is it oh my gosh and this happened to me whenever i first opened it i wasn't sure which was the brightest which is the dimmest but this is this is this is it this is it let, let me check never mind okay that's that, that that was it that was it that was it okay the lightest mode doesn't seem too bad, so I definitely like, I'm looking at myself, I'm sorry. But I definitely like how it looks. It looks pretty good. Pretty decent for a video. This is the lowest setting, and the quality is still good on its own. And this is the brightest. Super good quality ring light. 
it is small convenient affordable so i definitely recommend for you to check it out on the link down below in the description box in case you want to purchase it or you know you could go ahead and click the link and look at some other ones in case that one wasn't as convenient for you you could go ahead and check some other ones out and that's it that's the whole review of my ring light you've made it to the end of the video if you made it to the end of the video don't forget to comment like and subscribe to keep up with more videos of me myself and i you can go ahead and check the description box down below to be able to get the link for the ring light and i will also be linking down below the link for my tripod that i also purchased on ebay so you can go ahead and purchase both on ebay they are both pretty affordable nothing above 20 dollars. So you can go ahead and check that out i will also be linking down below my most recent videos so you can go ahead and watch that thank you so much for watching